Good evening and welcome to News 10 on my Fox 10. The record breaking heat continues in the Wabash Valley, but one industry is bearing the brunt of the heat. Construction workers are having to deal with the dangerously hot conditions. News 10's Hannah Fullman is live tonight in Vigo County with more. Patrice, even at 10 o'clock at night, it's still relatively hot out here. And during the day, those temperatures are even warmer. But still, construction workers are out here each and every day, making sure our local roads are safe, even if that means 100 degree heat. Temperatures are warming up and more Vigo County road projects are underway. But even local construction work does not stop in excessive heat. It just means we have to be a little more careful in the things we do. Larry Robbins is the Vigo County Highway Director. He says temperatures like these are not something completely out of the norm for construction workers. A highway a highway employees work in all manner of you know environments out there you know in the in the climate. So I mean, they work in the extreme heat and they work in the extreme cold. So um, they're kind of used to. I wouldn't say they're used to it, but. They know what they need to be doing uh, on certain days like that. Robin says they do safety reviews and training sessions several times each year. So everyone is extra prepared, especially in temperatures like these. But there are also ways to work around these rapidly rising temperatures, one of which includes the time of day you are working. Some people go to nighttime shifts, but a lot of people go to early morning shifts so they can get out there and beat the heat so they can get their job done. Other ways include taking more frequent breaks, using cooling pads, drinking more water, and most importantly, looking out for one another. You know, monitor um, your own situation as well as the people that you're working with. Make sure, you know, if you see a guy kind of look dizzy or, or, or maybe a little pale, you know, make sure, make sure you don't just ignore that and make sure you look out for those guys. And because those can be signs of fatigue and, and heat stroke as well. Although days with intense heat bring on several challenges, Robin says the job always gets done safely and efficiently. As of now, Robin says the road work should still be on schedule and there should be no delays. And if you happen to see or know a construction worker, make sure you thank them for all their hard work. Reporting live in Vigo County, Hannah Fullman, News 10.